do we have here? A new setup? Maybe. I mean, basically what happened was uh, I'm having some technical difficulties right now with my usual setup, so I'm having to kind of resort to one of my older setups right now. Um, but hey, maybe I'll kind of stick with this. Who knows? You guys let me know if you like this setup or not. But I'm going to kind of, uh, you know, make the wall nice and fancy behind me and stuff. So that, you know, it's not just a blank wall behind me. So anyway, I'll be working on that as well. But let me know if you like the setup or not. But basically, the thing that we're going to talk about today is Francis Ford Coppola. The legendary director of the Godfather trilogy. Or at least the first and the second one. We don't really try to count the third one if we can help it. But he has some interesting words to say about Marvel. As we know, Martin Scorsese has been saying some pretty critical things about Marvel recently. In, I believe, three different interviews, he kind of gives updates about how he feels about Marvel. And the first one, he's like, you know, it, uh, Marvel is just, you know, it's, it's not real cinema. And then the second one, he's in the second interview, he was like, yeah, Marvel is still not cinema, but even worse, it's like theme park rides, but that's just kind of how cinema is becoming now. And then in the third one, he was just kind of like, yeah, Marvel's just bad. Um, <laughs> so, and now we have Francis Ford Coppola coming out and basically agreeing with what Mar Martin Scorsese has to say. So, this is what he has to say here. I'm going to have to uh, open up on my phone here. I don't have my computer in front of me. It's literally just you right in front of me. So, hi, how's it going? Uh, so, anyway, this is what Francis Ford Coppola has to say about Marvel. So, when Martin Scorsese says that the Marvel pictures are not cinema, he's right because we expect to learn something from cinema. We expect to gain something, some enlightenment, some knowledge, some inspiration. I don't know that anyone gets anything out of seeing the same movie over and over again. Martin was kind when he said it's not cinema. He didn't say it's despicable, which I just say it is. So, Francis Ford Coppola, I feel like he has to, I think he feels like he has to one-up Martin Scorsese in a way he's like well I mean you know I'm a better director than than Martin Scorsese so how can I one up Martin here let's see here ah I know I'll, I'll I will just say that Marvel's not cinema I'm gonna say that Marvel is despicable that will show Martin heh <laughs> really got him that time I feel like that's kind of what's going on here so yeah Francis Ford Coppola says that Marvel is despicable which is pretty, those are some pretty bold words, okay? You know, like I said, he's a legend, okay? He's given us some of the best movies, some of the greatest movies all, of all time, like The Godfather, The Godfather 2. But, you know, at the same time, I don't agree with him. I don't agree with him that Marvel is despicable. Marvel has been very, very influential. I would say that, you know, there's more... Um, there's more that can be, uh, I guess, agreed with when it comes to Martin Scorsese and what he says about, like, it not being cinema. But to say that Marvel's despicable, I don't know. I don't agree with that. Maybe he's just saying that he despises Marvel, which, you know, is fine. But to say that Marvel is despicable is another thing entirely, right? Um, on top of that, like, he, uh, you know, he says, we expect to gain something, some enlightenment, enlightenment, some knowledge, some inspiration from cinema. You know, th those are types of things that you can gain from Marvel as well. Like, maybe not, like, enlightenment <laughs> or, uh, knowledge per se, per se, but inspiration, definitely. Like, I've been inspired by Marvel, not just, uh, you know, to be more of a, I guess, heroic person in real life and stuff, you know, to, to do the good things and stuff. Like, I wouldn't say that it's just solely Marvel that has inspired me that way. It's a lot of movies that have inspired me in that way. Um, you know, going all the way back to Spider-Man, Spider-Man 2. Those movies especially inspired me to, you know, think about how can I be a, a hero in everyday life. Marvel, at least, you know, kind of in the earlier stages of Marvel, definitely carried that same type of feeling. Um, I wouldn't say that, you know, you know, it just kind of depends. Some of the movies definitely don't do that, but some of the other Marvel movies definitely do. But, you know, I don't know. Like, I, I just don't, I just don't agree with him on that. You know, I, I think that you can get inspiration from Marvel. And, uh, you know, everyone gets inspiration from different things. Some people, you know, there, there's plenty of little kids, I'm sure, 
that are seeing Marvel that are getting inspired by it. Not only that, but Marvel's inspired me to per pursue other things like creative ideas that I have. So, you know, Marvel has been inspirational to me in some way. I wouldn't say that Marvel's really been enlightening necessarily, even though, you know, there are some things that you can take away from some, some of the Marvel movies that are like good moral things as well. But yeah, like, I just don't think that, that he is being completely fair with Marvel in this point. You know, I, I actually kind of agree more with Martin Scorsese and what he says um, over after thinking about it some more and after Martin Scorsese kind of more clarified his comments and stuff than I do with Francis Ford Coppola. I straight up do not agree with Francis Ford Coppola here at all. I don't. Um, you know, saying that Marvel's despicable, eh, that's, that's kind of pushing it a little bit far, man. But... Anyway, those are just kind of my general thoughts about it. Let me know in the comments below what you think about this. Let me know as well what you think about the setup. I know it looks kind of boring right now. It's just whiteness. And who likes whiteness, right? <laughs> uh, um, anyway, but yeah, let me know in the comments below what you think. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will talk to you all very soon in another video. I'll watch you later. Bye.